almost lost my life. All right, let's do that again. guys and thanks for tuning in for another video. In today's video I will be doing a full wash day using Inspire by Made Beautiful Collection. Before cleansing my hair I will start by applying a generous amount of the pre poo detangler which contains shea butter, honey, and coconut milk. This product claims to soften and detangle from 3B to 4C hair. Next, I'll be using the Creamy Coconut Milk Cleanser. This product contains shea butter, honey, coconut oil, coconut milk, chamomile, and sage. This product claims to cleanse and detangle your hair. And last for my wash, I'll be using the Creamy Coconut Milk Conditioner. This product claims to nourish and hydrate your hair.
Alright guys, and I'm back. So, I have finished using every single product from the Inspire line by May Beautiful, and I'm just going to share with you very briefly, hopefully I keep this brief, my thoughts and opinions of each of these products. Okay, so the first product I want to talk about is the Pre Poo Detangler. I don't have anything bad to say about this product. This actually was really good. Now you can actually wet your hair and use this product before you shampoo, or you can actually put it on your hair dry. Um, I should have put it on my hair dry cause, so y'all can see, you know, my reaction to um, when it's initially applied to dry hair because it's just like applying it to wet hair, like it quickly absorbs into my hair strands and it starts, it just basically starts melting all the tangles and knots away from my hair and it definitely is easy to work through with a wide tooth comb. So I really like this product. I was actually thoroughly impressed because I was not expecting to get the results I did. I could easily detangle through my hair. Yeah, this was just a really great product. So I really enjoyed it. It smells good. Um, no, I'll take that back. <laughs> For some reason, I thought it smelled good, but it smells like mayonnaise. I don't know why it smells like hot mayonnaise. Yeah, to me, it smells like a, a hint of, of, of mayonnaise. So the product claims it softens and it tangles your hair, and it did just that for my hair. It moisturized my hair. As far as slip, I would give this product of a one through a five, I would give it a four when it comes to slip. It had pretty decent slip. So I was, again, very impressed. So the next item is the Creamy Coconut Milk Cleanser. The claims of this product, it claims to cleanse and detangle. Cleansing, I would say yeah, it was definitely cleansing. Detangling, it was okay as far as detangling goes. So once I got this cleanser into my hair strands, I would say it was pretty easy to detangle my hair um, as soon as I got the product worked in really well. I would say it was very moisturizing, very conditioning. I had no trouble detangling with this product, so it was definitely very easy on my hair. As far as the lather, it definitely has a very heavy lather. You wouldn't think um, that a creamy coconut milk would have a huge lather. It really doesn't take all that much. It lathers really great on your hair, so just a little bit is what I would recommend. I will say upon application of this product, it did penetrate my hair fairly well. It did take a little bit of time. It took maybe three applications um, for me to really get my whole hair uh, covered in this uh, product. But once I got the product worked in, it was definitely very easy to manage my hair. Once the product penetrated my hair, I was able to detangle. And yeah, so product claims, I would say, is true. Okay, next is the Creamy Coconut Milk Conditioner. Now, this product, I had a little struggle. This product does not seem to be for low porosity hair. Um, it made my hair feel a little strawy like um, it, it sounded and kind of felt a little rough. I don't know why, but the cleanser was good, but the conditioner, not so much on my hair. It just didn't really seem to really take to my hair and it took a lot of working the product into my hair for it to really penetrate my hair strands. So I, I don't know what was going on with that. Um, but the product claim, it says to nourish and hydrate. I would say that once I rinse this product out of my hair, I just let it kind of, I actually walked around for a little bit before I actually started styling my hair. And my hair did dry, semi-dry, and I would say that my hair was very soft. One thing is I would not recommend detangling with this conditioner if you have low porosity hair, because it's just like my hair cuticles just closed up, and trying to detangle my hair with this conditioner was like, it was like a uh-uh, no-no. <laughs> What I like about Buy Made Beautiful products is not only do they tell you what the product is, on the bottles it tells you what the product does for your hair or what it's going to do for your hair. So I really like that about the packaging of these products. So you don't have to guess what these products do before you purchase the products. It tells you on the bottles. Next is the Leave-In Detangling Conditioner. Um, the product, the claims of this product is that it detangles and nourishes. <clears throat> Detangling. <laughs> yeah, this product did not do well in detangling my hair. If anything, first of all, this is not for low porosity hair, again. 
There's two products so far in this line that is just not for low porosity hair. Now the reason why you saw me squirt this in my hand, because if you notice, this shoots out a very straight stream. It's not a mist of any kind. I cannot properly distribute this product through my hair when it's shooting straight streams right upside my head. I had to put it in my hand, work it in my hands, and then into my hair. And as you saw, and I don't know if you could tell, but it is very foamy. And I did not expect that, even though I have used quite a bit of this product, what I use it for is just really my roots. If I'm trying to get into detangle my roots, if I'm going to do a twist out or um, not a twist out, but if I'm going to do uh, a flat twist, I will use this if I'm trying to just trying to get to my roots and do a quick flat twist. But as far as my whole hair, I would not recommend putting this so much on top of your hair. I would recommend putting this on your roots because it actually softens, gets into the roots and softens it up where you can detangle from the roots easily. But once you start putting this on your hair, again, those hair cuticles are gonna close up and it makes the detangling process a mess. I had a struggle, like a real, real, real difficult struggle trying to detangle my hair once applying this product. You do not want to detangle your hair, your low porosity hair, with this product. It's definitely very conditioning that I will give it. Now, once you get the foam and stuff pretty much worked in, it's gonna dry, but initially it's kind of like a shock and it dries clear. It doesn't leave any, you know, particles in your hair, no um, little white beads or anything like that in your hair. So it, it's still a pretty decent product, but um, I have to disagree with the product claims as far as the detangling goes. Okay, as far as the styling products go, I got the um, Manageability Milk Styling Lotion. And this is for the, the product claims is to detangle and strengthen. I will say yes, this is definitely a good softener, hair softener and detangler. And I also got the Hydrating Jelly. The product claims that this product is to define and defrizz and would I say the product claims are true? Yes, I did get definement and defreezing with this product. Both of these products actually work really great on my hair, but not together. So I tried to uh, cocktail these products and it did not work. It left a lot of white residue in my hair. So I would not recommend cocktailing the uh, styling lotion and the gel. But yeah, the product claims are both of these products are very true. Uh, they definitely soften my hair, define my hair. Uh, for the most part, just softening my hair and, and uh, just detangling my hair. So yeah, I would definitely say that I had no issues at all. None at all with these products. I have nothing bad to say about these two items here. It's a very lightweight gel and the lotion is also very lightweight as well. They're not greasy at all. They're not sticky or tacky on your hair, but they just don't mix together. So yeah, no problems and I love these products. And lastly, for my styling product, I use the Curly Temple Balm. Now, this particular product, you can use it as an edge control. It also says that you can use it for the ends of your hair, as far as like twist and braid outs to eliminate frizz. Um, what I did find out about this product is that when my hair was like really wet and there were certain pieces that were just not really curling, I would use this and it will curl those pieces right up because I have a lot of very straight uh, pieces of hair. They're not as defined, not as curly. And it seems to be like this little patch of hair right here is straighter than all the rest of, of my hair on my head. And it's very hard to get this part um, defined. And it has a very light hold to it, but just enough to define your curls and give you the definition that you need. It's not heavy on your hair. Your hair still feels very light. At least for me, it does. It felt very light on my hair and to define my hair and kept those, those curls in place. This is a really great stuff for eliminating frizz, twist outs, braid outs, wash and goes, even though it doesn't say it, but it's actually good for a good wash and go if you just want to use this product by itself and a little goes a long way, like I said. This is some good stuff. So I highly recommend getting the Curly Temple Balm. So just to give you my overall thoughts of the turnout of my hair and my full, um, I guess, grade on this line, I would give this line 
a B minus. This is still a great line. I got really great results from the product. It took a little bit to get there, <laughs> but I got there. My hair got there. And overall, I am totally satisfied with each of these products because all of them working together gave me the outcome and the results that I wanted. And I think it's a really cute uh, style and uh, curls. And I got great definition and shine and all these things so yeah so yeah I thoroughly enjoyed all these products and I also want to thank once again by May beautiful for sending these products my way so this concludes the video guys I hope you enjoy watching me test and try all of the products in the inspire collection by May beautiful I really enjoyed it and once again thank you uh, by my beautiful for making it possible for me to test out these products in this line so if you like this video don't forget to do the normal like comment and subscribe it's just janine i will see you guys on the next video bye guys bye.